What's up, Hacktroid Crypto family? Welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new here, subscribe for everything about cryptocurrency and blockchain. And today I'm going to be talking about a very exciting project that you guys have probably already heard about called Dragon Chain. Dragon Chain is effectively trying to change how businesses interact with the blockchain through securing data. And it's really exciting to know that they are based just north of me in Seattle, right around the same area as Microsoft and Valve and some other exciting companies in Bellevue. So I wanted to dive in. A lot of you guys have requested this type of review from Dragon Chain. So I'm gonna run over, check out their website, go through my thoughts on it, and let's dive right into it. For me, as someone that is based in the US, this initially is the first thing that stands out to me, the US based. Let's go down and see what their video is all about here. From the Disney team that released Dragon Chain Open Source comes the Dragon Chain Commercial Platform and Incubator. First, let's look at the Dragon Chain platform that focuses on protection of business assets. It's a turnkey and scalable environment using a serverless architecture that empowers smart contract developers to use established programming languages such as Java, Python, Node, and c -sharp. In addition, all smart contracts have full access to Amazon AWS services and capabilities. Next, let's look at the Dragon Chain Incubator that standardizes the process to launch a blockchain project. It provides early access to exciting projects and is scaled by active crowd participation. Now let's look at the Dragon Chain Marketplace, an ecosystem of verified subject matter experts across disciplines such as crypto, marketing, legal, software development, and recruiting. Also included in the marketplace are libraries of pre-built smart contracts monetized by developers for reuse. Finally, the Dragon, a tokenized micro-license to access all services across the Dragon Chain platform and ecosystem designed for blockchain business magic. Be a part of the most secure, flexible, and business-friendly blockchain platform and ecosystem. Buy Dragons, starting October 2nd. So the quote here from the architect and the CEO is unlike existing platforms with Dragon Chain, you retain complete control of your data, sensitive business logic and smart contract functionality is kept proprietary. This is really exciting for me just because I'm based, you know, in San Francisco, which is south of uh, Seattle and this kind of surrounding area here. So if you look at some of the big name companies around here, Expedia, Amazon, Disney, uh, which is kind of where Dragon Chain spun out of. You have on the other side of the uh, Lake Washington, Bittrex, Valve, and Dragon Chain, just south uh, west of Microsoft, which is really very cool. I like the fact that they do this almost to resonate with US-based um, investors and just kind of interested nerds like me. I think that, you know, they're making it very, very apparent that they're based in the US and that, you know, they're going for the global reach. Going through their three parts of the business, they have their platform, which is the scalable serverless platform uh, with built-in projection for businesses data. And uh, it's allowed to be integrated with uh, current programming languages like Java, Python, Node, and C Sharp. It's developer friendly. And I think that this is probably the primary um, reason here. This last part that, you know, obviously Dragon Chain is developing great technology, but I do think that taking a developer first approach is very well known in the space for um, just becoming, becoming a success because primarily developers are at the core of cryptocurrency and a lot of projects. So catering to them uh, just ultimately is, is a good strategy. Their next pillar is their incubator. It's basically a way to give access to developers and they want some, some additional blockchain enthusiasts like myself, as well as, you know, some professionals to help get them out into the world and, and get their projects spun up and, and running. Their marketplace is the final pillar. And that's where you get to essentially go across all the different vendors, whether it's legal people, uh, legal people, 
uh, we'll say attorneys, I'll call them developers, as well as your marketing and just kind of overall specialized qualified uh, experts. And I think that the mixture between the incubator and the marketplace is to help nurture innovation with Dragon Chain. And this whole, these three pillars are a great cocktail for success. And I'm, I'm, I'm a big fan of that. The Dragon Scale Incubator, so it's called Dragon Scale, and it does do a quick overview. You submit an application online. Uh, applications are vetted automatically by their Dragon Chain standards and ranked in a proprietary system. And their approved applicants will be sent an invitation to join the incubator system pending contractual agreements. So after you're accepted, you will be immediately listed within our system as an incubator project with access to the platform in Q2 2018 and Marketplace in Q4 2018. So as you can see here, um, they are already working with different companies. So companies will be shown when they have launched. So Look Lateral, Metropolitis, um, BioCrypt Technologies, Give With Nothing, and Lagoon. These are their slots that are open, and I haven't heard many people talking about this. Blockchain technology is software that influences human behavior. Dragon Chain envisions great impact on future systems such as social, financial, health, and privacy. But how will the world find and support the next Facebook, Twitter, Google, etc.? In the existing process, behind closed doors, a small group of investment bankers choose winners and losers. This small group has limited information about the true value of a project and market needs. In this outdated model, founders of a project suffer from heavy dilution and spend more resources on pitch decks and meetings versus creating market value. Dragon Chain's crowd-scaled incubator will apply prediction market mechanics to choose, scale, and accelerate projects. Prediction markets allow more people with better information to contribute to a decision, so founders can focus more on building their business. All this made possible with Dragons. Be a part of Dragon Chain's crowd-scaled incubator. Buy Dragons today! So very exciting that they're offering the Dragon Scale Incubator to startups and uh, just various entrepreneurs. I think that this is a very empowering concept and uh, I love the little pie they're doing there about VCs taking everyone's, everyone's equity. Uh, but really proud of, of, of their incubator concept and, and I'm, I, I'm excited to try and see some of these projects sprouting out and, and reviewing some of these as well in the future. That does it for my quick overview of the Dragon Chain website and kind of overall mission. I really enjoy the three-pronged attack that they're doing with the platform, the marketplace, and just the kind of overall ecosystem. Developers could go out and they could find legal, they could find marketing, they can find pretty much everything, and an incubator to just kind of help speed things up. So it's like a a trifecta of helping people develop, helping people get involved with the technology. And one of the big selling points I, I, I have a strong belief behind that is driving Dragon Chain to you know one of the top 100 projects is the fact that it's helping developers interface with it using different programming languages. So Java, Python, they're really helping regular developers interface with blockchain uh, and smart contracts, which is a very, very big driving force behind it. Um, I do think that a lot of developers are trying to get into the blockchain space or trying to find projects that makes that easier of a transition um, and just kind of learning. So I admire Dragon Chain for the fact that they're helping developers interface, they're helping companies incubate and, and launch, and they're helping you know just the overall marketplace of, of people that are in the space. I really love this project. I do think that it is a, a, a HODL type project. Uh, it's been around, I think they did their crowd sale last year in October 2017. Overall, very exciting team mission. And this year in 2018, around the time that I'm filming this video, uh, they're going to be releasing their platform and their beta. So 
everything's already been done, all of the complexities of raising money and uh, building up their community and building up a powerful base of, uh, of transaction volume and testing their product. They are gonna be rolling it out publicly this year. Um, if you look at the roadmap uh, that I went over briefly, you can see that 2018 is dedicated completely to this beta and, and rolling it out for the public. So I'm excited to test it out. I'll probably do a follow-up to this video just based on you guys, uh, on how much interest there's been around Dragon Chain. So I'm gonna check it out. I'm gonna dive into it once it's available. And I haven't talked to their team yet, but I'd love to learn a little bit more about how the, diff the three different pieces fit together with the token. Um, as well as there was a, a piece that's mentioned in there about developers monetizing contracts that they've already made. Uh, so taking smart contracts that they've already developed and monetizing it through Dragon Chain's platform in their marketplace, that's interesting to me um, and a lot of people that I know. So I would like to learn a little bit more about that and just kind of dive in there a little bit later once they have it available to the public or me early, that would be nice. Uh, but if you guys like this review, hit that like button. If you guys are new here, join the family and subscribe and hodl. These are my new, my new signs here in the background. Uh, after a lot of requests from you guys, wanted something in the background instead of just my head floating. So I made these signs, they're pretty dope, but I'll see you guys on the next review. Give some love in the comment section down below and I'll see you guys next time.